All right, have and have not fans, you know the drill. If you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button as well as the bell notification icon. Help me hit 40,000 subscribers before new episodes air on August 14th, which isn't too long from now. So 40,000 is right around the corner. Please help me make that dream a reality, which is one step closer to the main long-term goal of the channel, which is 100,000 subscribers. And with that being said, this is a video fans have been asking me to do for... Uh, probably about a month. I think it was like ever since the episode right after the pimp slap. I forgot what it was. Was it th Team Arrivals is when the slap happened, right? You know, I don't even want to think about that. I know somebody will tell me in the comments. But anyway, um, just wanted to say this video is about the possibility of Veronica being physically abused as a child. My gosh, didn't I, didn't I do a video about what if she was a lesbian when she was younger? What if her mom was a lesbian. I don't know. I did a lot of stuff like that. I forgot. But this is a different angle here. I mean, everybody is going on about the fact when she got slapped and then in the next episode, she literally lost her mind or what, what was left of it. She was like, Mama, he hit me. He hit me. He hit me. So people have been chalking up. And again, I'm not mad at it because it really shows that fans are out there thinking like I am. Well, not ex well, we all don't think alike. But what I mean is we're all paying attention to the little things these characters do and say and building larger theories around it. And I appreciate that. And then for people reaching out to me to actually do a video means a lot. And it really shows that you all trust me with these theories. And I all love the fact that you all reached out to me. I'd say about 18 people did. So that's probably why I'm not going to shout anybody out because there are so many I can't remember. But in any case, now, given the fact that like, mama, he hit me, the biggest question well actually questions when you think about it number one was veronica physically abused as a child number two did she see her parents like you know was her dad physically abusive to her mom and was it possible number three was it possible that veronica was possibly in an abusive relationship before she got married to David. I feel like all three of those are valid, valid um, statements or questions to ask because what did she say? The two rules, and I forgot the exact order, but I do know the two rules were never cheat on me and don't ever put your hands on me. So, slash hit me. So, um, hmm. It is possible, all three. I, wanna, I ain't gonna lie. It is possible because just because, you know, her... She, maybe she saw her mother being physically abused. Who knows what kind of person that, well, I would say who knows, but I feel like Catherine or somebody probably said this in the show, but I forgot. Like, I know a lot, but I don't know everything. And like I said, I know some uh, well-versed fans will let me know in the comments, but who knows what kind of father or husband and man that her dad was. Like I said so before, this was probably mentioned, but I totally forgot. But let's say that maybe he was the kind of man that hit women and cheated on Veronica's mom. That's why those are the two things that she really didn't want in her marriage, which is strange because she did both of those things to David, you know, slept with Benny Young and who knows how many other men possibly during their marriage, not to mention constantly hitting him, slapping him, then destroying his property and attempted to kill him. But you know, Hey, neither here nor there. And, um, you know, he probably hit Veronica too, you know, like I wouldn't say sexually, I don't think sexual abuse, but I feel like he was definitely, Ooh, but Veronica did, uh, did tell Jeffrey one time and what was it? Season two, when they were driving back from the Sarandon after she saw David walk out of his room with Maggie and then Landon walked out of his room with Jeffrey and on the drive home, it was about sex It's like. The first time, I didn't really like it either, but I had to do it over and over again until eventually it felt normal or I liked it or something like that. Mm, I Honestly, I would hate to even say this because keep in mind, this show has definitely crossed a lot of lines on different things. It is possible that, you know, her dad physically abused her and sexually abused her as well. What's the word? Molested. And she didn't like it the first time, but then the more she did it, the more she, you know, didn't really mind it. So it is possible that she was physically abused and sexually abused by her father. I'm not ruling that one out. 
And then that goes on to that other question. I think I mentioned this a few seconds ago. You know, maybe she saw what kind of man her father was, what kind of husband he was to her mother. And she knew that if I ever get married, my man can't either hit, well, can't hit me nor cheat on me. Those are the two things I won't tolerate. So I can definitely see that. And then the third, what was the third thing? What was the third? I should have wrote this down. Uh, um, dang. Oh yeah, yeah. If Veronica was in a physical relationship in the past where she was being physically abused by a boyfriend, not much to say on that because we really don't know much about her dating past aside from the one guy in college that knocked her up and then left her. So, eh, I, I can see that happening. Yeah, I can see possible abuse. But um, yeah. This video really isn't as long as I thought it'd be because really, you know, not really rambling on, just getting to the hard facts here. I, I just wanted to voice my opinion. I think one of the three scenarios, if not all the above, but let me know. Uh, do you feel that maybe that in the past when she was younger, Veronica was physically abused by her father or possibly another male in her family? Who knows? But the fact that she was like, he hit me, mama. It, it made it feel like, you know, she was regressing back to her childhood and just saying things that she hadn't said since she was a kid. Kind of like, you know, if you watch The Flash season four when he got out of the Speed Force, he was just spitting gibberish around from previous seasons and earlier points in his life as well as the present and future. But, you know, I don't want to confuse everybody here if you don't watch The Flash. But I think it is possible that after being hit so hard, not to mention being drunk, because who knows how much he drank that night and not being mentally stable to begin with, I feel like her saying, he hit me mama, is Veronica regressing mentally back to a state in her pre or earlier life where she was hit by another person, mainly a male, so probably your father. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below on this, on the Ice Queen being physically abused when she was younger. Uh, what do you think of this theory? Do you have any points or questions that I didn't even bring up in this video that you would like me to address? As I said before, please hit at the... Uh, uh, see, I feel like I got hit like Veronica and I'm slurring. Please hit that subscribe button because 40,000 subscribers is right around the corner.